So according to Aristotle, objects all fall at a constant speed, and that speed depends on their weight. Now when Aristotle says constant speed, what he means is that the instant you release a ball, it's already traveling at the same speed that it will hit the ground with. Okay, so objects fall at constant speed, and that speed is proportional to the mass. Now what does this mean, speed proportional to mass? It means that if you double the mass of an object, you double the speed. If you triple the mass, you triple the speed. We can write this proportionality with this funny looking symbol here. It actually looks a little bit like the alpha we saw in the first unit. Now we can use these proportional relationships to make mathematical calculations. So let's say we have two objects, a one kilogram and a two kilogram mass. If this one falls with a certain speed S1, this one will fall with the speed S2. The way we can use this proportionality relationship to make a calculation is in the following way. We say that the ratio of speeds, S1 to S2, is equal to the ratio of masses. And we can say that because they are proportional. So in this simple example, I just want you to tell me if S1 is 2 meters per second and these are the masses, what is S2? Well, we can just plug in here. 